the fiends must be driven back. And what better place to begin than the seat of our noble line? Continue the onslaught. Destroy them all. As the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. Another one falls. Their formation is broken. Maintain the offensive. Disadvantage. Give them no quarter. Foolish horrors. Brought low and driven into the mud. Even the cold stone seems bent on preventing passage. So normally I don't talk during these. But one thing I will note about the privateer. Is a lot of her sound files or just don't exist. Some things she does won't have any like audio cue or anything like that. And funny enough, when I use 
hunt them down. The arsonist. The little bounty icon appears on his chest instead of above his head. I have no idea what that's all about, but I just found that interesting. Anyway, uh, enjoy the rest of the video. Ah, you know what? I think I will talk through this. So, this party is the Genissary, Raviteer, Arsonist, and I'm using a modded variant of the Arbalet. Now, I'd like to try and showcase uh, different modded classes here and there. Of course, I failed to track check. Will find no clemency in this place. I want to use stuff that hasn't really been covered too much. A lot of people don't... I haven't noticed much talk about the Genisari. He's a great front line or a great back line. He's a really good guard and repost. Uh, with protection, he has a, a buff and some stress healing party wide stress heal a fairly decent uh front line slash brace the gun the buffs his uh arquibus shot and then to hurt is pretty decent for just like spreading damage around and all that and a pretty good decent debuff uh plus four percent crits received and minus age dodge Nothing to sneeze that way. You're looking at the crits. Crit critical hits are always a nice way to release stress from your party. You can land them. If only treasure could I am a little concerned about the corruption. stress on my Genisari. I'm not too concerned about the healing. I got a couple sources of healing in the party. And in case you haven't noticed, I'm running a bunch of modded class or modded enemies or just a spice thing i have over like a thousand hours in this game i needed something to change things up you know like this get a mark out and let's get some riposte action going so hot-headed bring him to the front go and let's get I could start with the stress okay let's try this um I'm just going to do the stress heal there's more better things I could do in that situation be gone fiend but Taking out one of the bone, bone courtiers. A nice touch. He is going to afflict. Yep. That's the not good. In. The shadows whisper of conspiracy. It's not good at all. Also, apologies if you hear any background noise with the uh, computer. <laughs> okay. Er. HP is getting a little bit low. Let's mark the bone courtier. And let's smoke bomb here. No. I'm not too worried about the uh, executed with impunity. Alright. Oh good. Three to six damage. Hmm. Let's do this. It's more repost action going. You know, trust the back line. Let me fortify it instead. Um. Okay. That doesn't hurt me too much. 
right? Confidence There's Shim off. The enemy crumbles. And I'm just gonna do this. I am running the arsonist or the fire damage patches that are similar to the runaway class mod. Alright, let's get some of this going. Get patched people up a little bit. Just a little. There we are. Seize this moment. Take care of that. Push on to the task's end. Use that. Wealth beyond measure. Unfortunate. Awarded to the brave and the foolhardy alike. Uh, let's touch up arsonist and and uh, sorry. All right. We have a terror fang there and arbalist in the back. I'm not too concerned about the terror fang much as I am about that arbalist there. What I'm going to do, I'm going to spend the privateer. The pulse open. It's fine. I'm going to mark the arbalist. And hopefully take it out with one or two shots. Eradicated. One shot. Okay. Cool. My next priority would be that terrifying. Let's, let's get some repost going. Yep, good, good. Uh, he's going on. Alright. Getting a little low there. Do this. Go. I really wish I had the medic greaves or the arbalist right now. That's okay. Um, four to eight. Yeah, might as well finish it off. We don't take more damage, and we get some more loot. The Heal the arsonist a little bit. But never hidden. It's I. This is why I don't like the terror things. <laughs> they do so much bleed. Uh, yeah. No. Let's do the arsonist again. Good. It'll be good. We'll be good. All right. Now hit him with an accuracy debuff. He should miss. Nope. Still hit. And he's stunned. Ooh, that's not good. Okay. thing has got to go. 65% chance, 70%. He's down to death's door. Teetering With a bleed, break. please Placing move after my ar ar the, the Arbalus. And you're stunned. Easy. Alright. Of course. <laughs> Good old darkest dungeon. You're probably gonna die, dude. Nope. You're good. Alright. More fire. Good dodge. Perfect. This expedition at least promises Ooh. success. Uh we cleared, but let's keep going. Let's keep going. Because I want to play around with this a little bit more. 
And of course, I, I, I really need supplies. Ignore that for now. Uh, of course, it's empty. Alright. Touch up your health. Do a new. Do a new. Before for one last hunger check. After the hunger check, we can leave. Alright. You gonna move back? Uh, nope, just stress. Okay. So. We have a torturer there. He's gonna focus fire one target and mark and bring them forward. So. Let's guard the privateer. Get the repulsed up. Mark the torturer. And it miss. Okay. In a way, that's actually a good thing. Okay. Bring the torture up front. Nope, failed. Alright, we have two repulse up front. Uh, try an arbless mark. There we go. Perfect. Alright. Now... I want to hit second rank with a mark. Hit the torturer. Obliterated. Took him out of the equation. Perfect. Ah, he moved backwards. That kind of screwed with me. I can still use dead ahead. Guess I'll stress heal. Dead ahead. Boom. Alright. Now I just have to worry about the defender. I'm not too scared about the Arbalist. Especially when that happens. Alright, let's see. Uh, start touching up health. Mark you. Oh, thank you. That's exactly what I was going to do. Smoke bomb this guy. And. And Mark is getting some work in. And it wasn't you. Ah. Uh, Alright. Now. Let's re up that. You're good. Lots of dodging. Perfect. All right. Mhm, mm mhm. Mm Let's see if we get a crit. Oh, just a nice finish off. Yep. Like that bounty. Uh, I guess I'll use hot headed. My die already. <laughs> All right. Um. Do I still get the treasure if I kill it without a mark? Ah, let's mark him anyway. I want treasure, I am greedy. Yay! Ah, oh, 
it, okay, it doesn't trigger on a repulse kill. A That's unfortunate. Actually. You don't get the bunch of bones after a repulse. Yeah, Privateer, um... It's missing a couple sound files. Which is, uh... Not ideal. We just got pretty nice animations and stuff. Uh, Janissari is probably my favorite of these four, next to Arsonist. Janissari is not the strongest class, but it's also not the weakest. It, it performs very well as a frontline tank. You get a little bit of stress healing, you get some nice, uh, very high crit value out of Tempered Slash. And Archivist Shot is pretty damn good, in general. Overall, it, it's a solid class. You know, I like it. It can function well up front or in the back. That thing I need to kill. Like, yesterday. This is from Koala's Mod. If I remember correctly. Let's kill that thing with prejudice. Alright. Health is getting a little low there. Could up the light level. Let's do this. Five to seven. Get you with the fire. Wait. Okay. Then guard. Privateer. Uh, start healing. Of course not. Never mind. Shoot the soldier. Not bad, not bad. There's him off. Uh, yeah. Might as well get some more loot. Weird way to work for Lou, but hey, I'm not going to complain. As victories mm -hmm. mount, so too Let's will see. resistance. Uh, don't really need it. You get rid of the torches. Do I need the shovel? I don't think I need the shovel. All right. I'm going to ignore those books. Since this was a room battle quest. All right, there's the hunger check. Oh. Mechanical hazards possessed by evil intent. And there's nothing left. Okay. Let's end this off. More Not a terrible run. Devils I mean, 7900. It's not the best. It's whatever. Alrighty. Air player. Meticulous striker. Nice. Finally. Faithless, that's okay. Feels no pain. Holy crap. That on the Janissary? With the frontline repose tanking? That's very nice. Uh, I'm also running Quirk expansion mods. Snorlaxo being a very prominent one. A couple from Marvin Sayo. Once. Our estate was the envy of this land. Alright. Ignore the 629. That's a private mod I got installed. <laughs> I took, um, old nightmares and edited it. Because I'm going to be using a lot of heroes. Okay, so we have a magician with a custom skin. Fire hunter. Uh, moon cannon. Art, by the way, 
Highwayman. Practitioner. Sunward Isles um, version of an antiquarian. Grave robber. Alien. A DD2's runaways in DD1. I wonder how that's possible. <laughs> Anyways. Not a bad run. Uh, it's kind of a shame my genocide got afflicted, but I am not going to worry about it. I will, however, de-stress him. Because him having uh, feels no pain is nice. I can get rid of this over time. Plus 2 speed with Torch below 26. Dead Eye is, I guess, okay. Kind of conflicts with the Feels No Pain, but Feels No Pain is still good, like, even if I'm not using them in front line. Yeah, Genistari, really solid. Uh, hero class. I will have links to all four of these in the description below. But I do have Vermintide, I have Butcher's Circus, I have Farmstead Plus, Courtyard Plus, a whole bunch of enemy mods, Sunward Isles. I am worried about Save Bloat. I am running an altered version of the executive file that kind of expands the memory of the game. Stuff like that, like... I can have like 4,000 some uh, trinkets, stuff like that, but it doesn't save you from the buffs that are given from districts that would pretty much, well, double the size of your save file. I think it's like 10, maybe 15 megabytes. Once your save file hits that reach limit, it just, bleh, it poops out. Especially when you get a bigger graveyard. Now, I'm not the best Darkest Dungeon player. I'm not going to tote it. Most of my experience just comes from the long hours I've played. Anyways, guys. Take care. Uh, you gotta look out for another video like this. I'm not going to try to edit anything. I have no video editing experience whatsoever. I'm just doing this on my off time. Random heroes I throw together and just give you a raw footage. Anyways, take care. See you in the next one. Bye!